time to do Albert's story. <sighs> Feeling up with his protege, the young Philip. I vaguely remember Albrecht story. I didn't look a lot into this game prior to release and the demo and all that because I didn't want any spoilers for any stories. Um, Albrecht was the one who I picked during the original first demo. I couldn't get into it that time but I am interested to see. <sighs> I want to see stats. When I'm like Picking who to leave behind, I kind of want to see stats. And I'm kind of thinking Teresa I should leave behind. Her skills aren't too extreme, but I feel like I'd be lost without them. And it's a heavy hitter. Like a guarantee. Oh, wait. All work's supposed to be like a tank kind of thing. God. Damn it, this is so hard to pick. Because I have an attachment theory and Hannah a little bit more. Cyrus is just useful. <laughs> Teresa, I think, is so far the least in terms of usefulness. I think. Good God, this is so hard to debate. In my brain. Oh, this is going to be even more rough and I have all the characters and it's like, I only want to use you. Therion, I'm kind of, I'm not sure if I'm locked into having him as number one forever. I think I should be able to switch him out eventually, but I doubt I would. Like I said, I have an attachment. He's my boy. But, oh man. Hands off for just getting through those boss fights. But Therian hits hard fairly well, as also just because he's higher level than Okay, let's do Hannah. I might switch this around in a little bit. Once I finally get control again, I can go to the tavern and actually take a look at characters. You say that, but you're already saying that he fights like a score of men. And now he has numbers. So for an Earhart is betraying him.
Ой. Where is Philip? Okay, he was hiding. Good God. Exposition. <laughs> Good God. Okay. Oh, good lordy. I don't like these intros, but I committed to doing these first chapters, and I'm kind of interested to see. I'm definitely interested in seeing all of them because I plan on recording all of them, but at the same time, if all the following chapters are just a bunch of strung together cutscenes, it's going to get really annoying. Strung together cutscenes to a boss fight. <sighs> Wish I pray that's not the case. I seriously do. Though also I've heard not great things that these are very by the numbers stories and that's why I even sort of mentioned as I was going on in that flashback of yeah not of that night betrayed the leash because that is obvious. Frankly it reminds me of Final Fantasy XII. <laughs> 
so and Ophelia being the one to go off instead of her sister that's plain to see I think the only one I Teresa was sort of obvious in the fact that she just wants to go on an adventure who else had the had it had the master who went off so obviously she has to go after him uh, Darian I think was the only sort of curveball of you don't really know going into that that he's going to be tricked <laughs> into doing that so or at least wooden tails uh and I'm still very annoyed by how they choose to voice act and then minimal voice act. I'm very much uh, all or none or I mean it's because they do it in cut scenes where essentially you have no because it's the same as the in-game cutscenes. I don't know. It's weird. It just feels very haphazard. If they had... If it were cutscenes like... Final Fantasy, where it... The budget goes up, and the quality... And the quality changes, and it's more of a movie than just the character models moving around. Then I can understand there being voice acting versus no voice acting, but it all looks the same. And it just feels weird that there's no clear difference as to why some scenes are voice acted where others aren't. You know, I see characters in unique action, best line for that. All of can challenge townspeople to a duel. Okay, so this is like Hannah's thing. Okay. I feel mean. I'm beating up on a child. Now I feel really mean. <laughs> but it's not gonna stop me. <laughs> Grant Hannah was actually sicking Lyndon on those kids back in her flashback, so eh, I don't feel too bad. This seems like Slightly more fair fight. Right. To do yes. The main benefit is this already starts to boost me for when I have to grind for levels with Ulrich. Yeah, he's already level 2! It's gonna be a long road. <laughs>
Okay. You're not gonna be able to change my party just yet. Find the locator, stack in the village, I assume I should save here, do another one just in case. There we are. Actual fighter cutscene fight. Actual fight. I'm impressed. Which actually means you're gonna get some fair grinding done before I even have to deal with you. Which is so helpful. Good lord, you're getting beaten up. Break the middle, man. Attack all foes with sword. Okay. I should check that out sooner. Actually. Be able to handle being my heavy hitter. Maybe. I love that move. That move's amazing. How are you not level three? Those guys broke the distraction, another set of brigaders came into town. enjoys the odd irony and oddity that it is Ulbrich and all these valiant people asking Therian for help because he's a thief he got into his issues because he went into a fancy place and tried to steal from it that's his main point of issue was he's a thief 
who in doing what he does got himself in trouble oh lord they're so expensive Poor spirit slightly cheaper. Yes. Oh. Ugh. Oh no, no, I trust it's great to have because she'll pick up money. I'm throwing on him just because he has the lowest stats of everyone because he's new to this party. Oh yeah, I need to put Teresa with the Memorial Harpoon. Equipment, Teresa. Oh, this one's... Could have given that one though. Damn. Yeah, I definitely could have given that one though. Damn it. Double dog, damn it. Okay. Whatever. <sighs> Going in without in it. It is a daunting task. I will take your bumps over though. Probably better than whatever the hell he has. It is. Thank you. <laughs> I'm honestly wondering what is increasing my odds in that, and I'm not sure. Is it just having party members from the town? Like, what makes it? Different. Okay. That has an issue. Fights because I'm grinding for this asshole. That's fine. No, nah, no vulnerabilities. Oh yeah, your health is still down from those fights earlier. Oh, now you leveled up, so no worries there. It does automatically heal them, right? Yes. Oh, God. I don't want to be called by surprise. So later today, I am planning on doing a stream. I haven't streamed in a while. That's sort of why I'm doing the recording. It is also because I haven't streamed in a while. And I'm trying to get into some sort of rhythm on talking on a microphone for a little bit. And I might take a break in between once I finish this and before I start doing that. That's Going from one to the other is exhausting. <sighs> yeah, definitely gonna take a break in between doing the two, probably. Also, because I have to shut off my main fan and close my window every time I do a recording, so it gets really hot. 
So, it may not be till late tonight. I'm hoping I'll still have energy because it will be a real bummer because I definitely needed to do this before I did anything, but it may be I need to do this and then do it tomorrow, which I will be not too happy about. Oh. Yeah, this will definitely work on this thing. There's something in front of Dagger. That is not sword. This? Oh, it's that. I thought it was sword, dagger, spear. What the hell? Okay. You're not allowed to go in different orders. And if you're going in the same order, then I'm not seeing that. Oh, that was decent damage, Cyrus. Bravo. My water bottle is cracked in the background. How nice of it. <sighs> but yeah. I am planning to and going to start to do more streaming stuff sort of fell out of it and I fell out of it sort of because I don't have great equipment for it and I have slightly improved on the equipment side of it um and definitely my experience is a little higher than it was definitely when I started doing all this so I definitely want to attempt to do more I wish my computer was better so I could do higher quality of stuff but that will be at a later time. Hopefully in a near future than a far off future, but that's definitely on the list. But I want to start getting into actually doing more streams and I think I know what games I sort of want to do just relaxing games. Like I plan on doing a lot of the Warriors games. Currently, specifically, I'm going for Hyrule, not Hyrule, whoa, uh, Pirate Warriors 3 for two reasons. One, I like it, and it's my anime bullshit, and the other reason is I'm actually fairly close to getting a platinum on that game, and I'm super nerd proud of that just because that is the only platinum I have actually worked for. I thought about getting platinum in other games, I just didn't care enough. And even this one's sort of like, okay, 